Assalamu alaikum boys and girls, how are you all? I hope you all are doing good. So in today's video, we are going to talk about the family of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa sallam. And today we'll talk about Sayyida Ruqayya binti Muhammad who was the daughter of Prophet sallallahu alaihi wa sallam. So let's get started. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Sayyida Ruqayya was seven. It was born seven years before Prophet sallallahu alaihi wa sallam became a prophet. She accepted Islam with her mother and sisters. She was married to Hazrat Usman bin Affan, who was the third caliph of Islam. When disbelievers in Mecca made life of Muslims very difficult, she migrated to Habsha, Ethiopia, with Hazrat Usman. There they got false news that people had become Muslims in Mecca. They went back happily but found that this news was not true. Sayyida Ruqayya also found that her mother Sayyida Khadija had died. She went back to Habsha. When Prophet Muhammad وسلم, migrated to Medina, Sayyida Ruqayya and Hazrat Usman also migrated to Medina. Allah blessed him, blessed both of them with a son who they named Abdullah. At the time of Battle of Badr, Sayyida Ruqayya got really sick from a very bad skin disease. Sadly, she died with that disease. Prophet Muhammad وسلم, was very sad on the loss of his daughter. Sadly, sometime later, her son Abdullah, who was a young boy, also died. So that, guys, was a brief overview about the life of Sayyida Ruqayya bint Muhammad. I hope you guys learned something from this video. Share it with your family and friends. And I'll, inshallah, see you in the next one. Till then, fi amanullah.